In this brief video we'll take a look at how legal and other users want to be able to work with PDFs in Office 365 SharePoint Online. Legal users frequently work with PDFs. For example, PDFs can be a way to transmit a document securely to and from other parties. Here in the Macro View pane in Outlook, we're clicking on a Word document which we'd like to send out as a PDF attachment. We can simply right click to send as PDF. The Word document is then retrieved from SharePoint Online, converted to PDF and attached to our email. If the organization has a smart photocopier, the legal user may well be receiving emails that have PDF attachments, with those PDFs being a scanned image of an incoming paper document. The name of the PDF typically is not very useful, so you can double click in order to open it in Adobe Reader. MacroView allows the user to save that PDF to SharePoint Online directly from Adobe Reader or Adobe Acrobat. Let's use the MacroView dialog to select the sample matter area and save our PDF with a much more meaningful name. MacroView will then prompt for metadata for the PDF exactly the same as if it was a Word document being saved to SharePoint Online. You can use the same technique to edit the properties of an existing PDF without having to reload that PDF to SharePoint. And of course, legal users need to be able to save Word documents to SharePoint Online as PDFs. Let's use Save As to SharePoint and again select the sample matter area from the Macro View dialog, this time choosing PDF format. We are prompted for metadata in the same way as always. Our document is now saved in SharePoint Online as a PDF. Legal users also need to be able to search for PDFs that are text-based using content in those PDFs. Here in MacroView DMF Explorer, let's search for all PDFs that contain the word SMART. For more information about working with PDFs in Office 365 SharePoint Online, contact MacroView using these details.